but let's make sure we walk and let people walk. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Come on. So we're out at the Zurich Classic today at, in the Kid Zone, and we're out at the first tea booth, and this year we're partnering with STEM NOLA to kind of have and show kids the science of golf and how different factors that you're gonna face outside will affect the flight of a golf ball. And STEM NOLA and Dr. Mackey were nice enough to go to the So wrote a little robot inside of the ball that's paired with the ball. Come on, ball! Get in and hold. Yay! We're here today uh, happily partnering with uh, First Tee and we're showing the kids golf through the lens of STEM. We have a wind tunnel where they actually can see the air flowing across the ball. They're enjoying the wind more than the visualization part. We have a 3D printer where we're showing them advanced manufacturing because we are printing 3D, we're printing golf tee. And we have edible soil to teach them about the environment on Earth Day. Golf kind of lends itself to science and technology. People don't understand that with golf, it's kind of a game of opposites, right? If you want to hit up on the golf ball, you have to hit down. You want to go right, you got to hit left. Left, you got to go right. Um, and it's more physics than anything else. But every golfer out here can kind of talk about how they have to hit a golf ball to flight it a certain way. And so the science and technology part of what happens in golf lends itself really well to the mission of STEM NOLA. It is so important to have this partnership because, uh, you know, we can teach kids about golf. And First Tee does a great job about that. But the amazing part is that when we marry the two, the kids get to have a lifelong sport, but learn the physics and science that they otherwise uh, get in school and they can apply it to their sport.